Okay. Now, it's an interesting thing. Because I just had to explain that I was that I was not a hacker. Because I have a 600, you know, you know I said, look, go on my YouTube channel. You can see it all done legitimately. And now someone's hacking me. Okay, so I was a little bit off. My actual playtime is 7,966 hours, so it's closer to 8,000 hours in game, which I will grant you is probably a lot of idling time, just letting this run 24 hours a day, day after day. So, how many days is that? 331 days, so not quite an entire year of playing the game 24 7. Yeah. That's how I got this rank. Like, no, man. It's, uh, there ain't no way you got the 600 plus ranking. And now I'm getting hacked. I wonder if I could see the whole conversation if I go into the, uh, the menu. Not the right time to do that, of course. Right now we just have to drive and hope that the modder doesn't bother us. I mean, it's just, that's all you can do with a modder. I'm willing to help. Oh, you think I thought, hey, I bet you're a modder. If I mod you a little bit, you'll show your true colors. No, I'm not a modder. I don't mod. Look, I got a, I've got a YouTube channel. And I can't make GTA videos if I get banned. I certainly don't want to keep buying the game over and over again and then starting over from scratch. My vehicles are, are prized possessions, you know? Oh, wait, I'm turning, I'm missing the... forgot where I'm going. Talking about all this modding and modders and this and that. Like, where are you going, Black Knight? Yeah. Cross the tracks. At least we got the stuff home. I know, I'm not gonna I'm not gonna risk losing, you know, a whole bunch of stuff. Shop to bits here a little bit. Eh, odd stuff. Why do they put the helicopter places like this thing? Now there's an approach. I'm getting modded. All right. Why would I invite myself to my apartment? Can we all have four? Yes. I'm not. So that's really great because first of all, if everybody got that message, they're all gonna think I'm the modder. The only thing I can hope. Is that you know me exiting as quickly as possible meant that nobody went to my apartment because my apartments were no longer there. I mean, does that really matter if you're dealing with a modder? It's yeah. But I had that whole thing where oh, I'm sure you're a modder. No, I'm not. I'm not a modder. And then some modder in game said, oh, let's make him look like a modder. Let's just have fun. But I'm not. I'm not a modder. Nope, nope. Pretty much now we want to go to another public, hopefully a different public session. Not the same session with a modder. But I mean, you know, it's, it's just so aggravating. Every time you have an interface with a modder, for the most part, it's aggravating. Even if they're throwing money at you, I don't want their fake money. It's going to get taken away from me anyway. I've only had a few different things. I remember I was in some in, in a 
in a Yuga Classic that would fly around the map. That was funny. There's been some things where you, you have a situation where they're spawning massive amounts of airplanes and it's, ah, ha, ha, ha. You have the, the big alien spaceships outside Maze Bank. Okay, some of those things are funny. But, I mean, to the extent that they can interfere with your game because they're blocking your, your way to places, no, not so much. Let's do the time warp again. Okay, are we in the same session or the different... God, we're with Kuleman. Kuleman? has joined the green alien gang. Very interesting. Very interesting. Okay. That's apparently the whole thing, where the green aliens are the green alien they go around and beat people up. And then the, the, the purple aliens will fight to save the humans, and then some humans, like, probably suck succulent lemon here. Succulent lemon will probably just go after the both sides. And some of the aliens dress up as green aliens to fight the green aliens because they don't see it coming. It's a very interesting time to be in GTA. In that it's really everyone just shooting each other. There's a lot of green aliens in this one. Say hello. Maybe he'll need a hand with her. She'll need a hand with something. It's so hard to tell in GTA. I can say that Kuleman does have an attractive female character. I have no idea what the nature of the real person Kuleman is. Was that just one of the guys? Excuse me, it's not the Rona. Excuse me, I gotta mute that. And here we go again. I wonder if they even saw that. Uh, Rockstar, can you know, you've made billions off of this, right? I mean, check me if I'm wrong, but GTA has made more money than like any movie, any video game, any album, any. It's the most. <sighs> you can see why they call it paradise. The most money of anything, any time ever. You think you could do some kind of anti-cheat program? If people are going to start coming after me just because of my rank, well then that's going to be, which is a new thing, that's going to give me lots of reason to use Rusty Jack until that becomes problematic, I guess. I don't know. I just want to get a couple crates. Is it so hard on a Friday night? And then there's always the cloud when you just you get kicked out and you try to get back in, and then you're trying to. It's like, oh, we'll just wait forever. All thanks to some silly modder. Silly, silly modder. 
All I want to do, if I get six more crates in my one, my one warehouse, I'll have nine in each, which is the max level that I'm aware of for solo sales. Which I don't want to. I don't want to murder this week on this. I don't want to like really grind like crazy this week. I want to take some advantage of it. Maybe get myself back to thirty million because I'm almost there. You know what I'm saying? Make a little bit of money, just so I have enough for the next DLC, and then give this a break. Maybe play some other video games. To be perfectly honest, mix things up a little bit. Make sure I have enough cash going so that if there's a wild sale, I can take advantage of it. That's really all I want. I don't even know a sale of what. I'm, I'm, I'm pretty well equipped at this point. I mean, I, I don't know. Here we are, joining GTA Online forever, and I can see myself quitting out of this game. Let's do the time warp again. Here we go again. Quit out of the game, and then you load it back up because you got thrown out. Of the game by modders, and now you need a fresh game. Fresh game, cause you're locked out. Fresh game, cause modders. Da -da 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 -da. <sighs> you know, the morning sessions are, are so much nicer. I'm not even in, I can see your stuff exploding. I should just, I should just wait till, I see what I was gonna do is do the, the riskier stuff here, where, you know, if I'm just going out to get crates, alright, I get blown up, I lose 20k. Who cares? At this point, that's not that big a deal. And then wait till the morning when all the the modders and the griefers and everybody have slept in, because they're all probably a bunch of sleepy beepies. I would imagine in the morning, and then you know, make your big money. That's this isn't going to be the big money run here. This is just just set up. I wasn't even going to record anything, but now it's gotten weird. And again, it's taking forever to load. Oh, finally, joining GTA Online. Boogada, 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 let's go. The pain is real, folks. The pain is real. It's so real. It's like, really? Really? I've already re completely rebooted the game. Come on. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, I'm doing something risky. I'm trying the join friends command, which will take me back to Kuhlman, but it'll take me back potentially to a modder if Kuhlman hasn't already been bounced out somewhere else as well. But Kuhlman's cool. So... But will, will it even work? I have no idea. I'm just trying different buttons. to see if I can trick the game into letting me play it. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Okay, first of all, let's pause and then clear the audio music audio. And somehow I click join friends and I'm in a solo session. There's Kuhlman. I did not join Kuhlman. I, I just I clicked to join friends. You have no friends. Yeah. Okay. Well, that's fine. We can. Will this work, or is it going to tell me I'm gonna? Did I somehow glitch out a, a a solo public session here? What goes on here? Boss. I mean, with any luck, this just won't even make the video because it's boring. Boring is what we want right now. <coughs> I don't want to be attacked by modders or green aliens or regular griefers or anything like that. It's there for taking. Get it and bring it back to the warehouse. I think it's going to be a similar problem. But we'll see. 
The last one I did, which was not really great, wasn't, well, you saw the end of it at the beginning of this video. I had to fly over and go ahead of the car and then shoot the guy out because you can't use handheld weapons from the Deluxo. But that's a, that is almost certainly a, a balancing feature of the Deluxo. The Deluxo would be utterly OP if you could use handheld weapons and throw sticky bombs and do everything else with it. I mean, it's... So what do we think here now? I think it's going to be fine. You have to keep a really close eye on the radar here. Because if you, as you get there, if it splits off into multiple targets, the last one that appears is the one you have to go for. Should probably turn off some of the junk on my radar so I can see better. But oh, this is the must be some clues in the area one. Oh dear. Search the area. Really? Well, this isn't too bad. I just like, shoot a wounded man who didn't know to stay wounded. There's oh, there's three crates. We have to go back and forth. And there's angry people chasing me. I think, okay, fine. Chase me over the mountain. This sort of thing is more suited for really a, a thruster or an oppressor mark too, because I don't think you have really quite enough flying speed out of this one. But it does fly on the ground when you put the wheels to it, and if you can get it, use it for the straight lines, and then when the curves come up, fly over stuff. And kick it. Carry some momentum into the flight. Then you make your speed up from just flying as the crow flies. Okay, after I found one, she locked onto the other two. Okay, so we can just have to go back, grab them, blah, blah, blah. Get in the car, fly back and forth. Now, here's an interesting conundrum. Do I? wait until tomorrow morning when I have some people in session so I get the 1% bonus? Or do I take advantage of the fact that I am right now in a solo public and no one's going to bother me? And it's, I don't know exactly even how I'm here. Like how did this work? Exactly. Where is it? It's supposed to be right here. I'm on top of it. Must be in the house. Is that it? Is it on the house? Is that the... No, up, up higher? Is it something like that? And you can see... You know, up here... Why is there a bike up here? <laughs> yeah, a little bit. Eat this. 
That was for shooting at me, you know? Don't shoot at me again. Now, I could have really screwed that up if it had hit, say, the other crate, but then again, eh. How much would we lose, really? You know, we might not get it anyway. We're running out of time. I don't know. I think I'm, I'm leaning towards, and this won't be very video, you know, compatible. It's not going to be real interesting. Is go back after this is all over, sell the two warehouses. Should get a half million out of that, no bonus. Sell my, uh, sell my bunker, which should be just, they'll give me one thirty-five profit, straight up, no bonus. No idea what's in the other. I should have at least, I would think, 400. Two, at least 200 in the, uh, the nightclub. But if it's got 400, then I've made a million dollars. Now, grant you, no bonuses, but no modders. No griefers. No headaches. Just playing the game. And let's be honest. Haven't I done a I, I think there's enough CEO in pajamas material out there that you're not going to be lacking for, for these view runs. I mean, you know, for next time. There's always a next time, right? If not, then it's been it's been real, you know. But who knows? Maybe a, you know we'll sell these off and maybe give it a break. I don't know. I haven't played off-world trading company in a while. Freelancer. Tomorrow might be a freelancer day. Got a TF2 video in the queue already that I haven't had a chance to edit yet. There's so much to do. And that's like, without me actually dipping into all the games I've bought on Steam and never played. Which, I don't know how many that is. Oh look, it's only a dollar! It's normally a hundred. We have to get it. That's a thing. I think that's that's a thing for everyone, right? Or is it just me? I don't know. And then, ah, just as I hit... Oh no, I don't have time for this. And just as I try to hurry up here and I hit a, a light pole trying to take off. We can use some speed here. We hit the five minute timer on the last one. See, I told you. There's a timer going on these, whether they show it to you or not. That is the one thing I didn't, never liked about... Well, there's a lot of things to not like about these crates. But I mean... Can we do... 2.3 miles back and forth. More than that back and forth in, in four minutes? Not likely. Not likely we're going to pull this off with the Deluxe. You kind of need something a little quicker like a thruster or a... Or dare I say it, the oppressor Mark Douche. But we're going to give it the college try. Come on, Deluxo, don't fail me now. Okay, where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Not on the upstairs. There it is. I'm not, doing, not, not firing the missile there. Okay, we were able to get it. Without leaving the car. Now if we can get out and across within two minutes. It says 3.7 miles, but that's on the road. This is going to be close. Okay, I've hit the, hit the ground running while it's in a straight line towards where I need to go because I can pull 127 miles an hour through here. And the instant I have to start thinking about maneuvers, jump jets up. Fall down. Oh, that was a bad twisty there. I don't think we're gonna make it. I think it's gonna be dang close. One mile and 44 seconds is tough. Come on. 
can we? I mean, they had to work at this to make sure that it was really close every time. We're not far. That goes to the block. Seven, six, five, four, one second to go. On that note, ladies and gentlemen, <sighs> this is your Black Knight. Did you forget about Simeon? Heck yeah. <laughs> this is your Black Knight. Have a great night. And here's a quick tip. That's the hard way around. Okay, well, not this. Here's a little bonus to show you. In case you're curious, yes, I've decided. Just to take advantage of the solo, and we're gonna go with no bonuses, crank some money. But that's that's neither here nor there. But this is one thing. That it's it's always easier just to kind of drive around here. Because this kind of puts you on the other side of fences or something. If you drive up past your garage, if you have that one, if you don't that garage. Ta da! Two hundred fifty-two thousand. Go go go! Truth be told, I don't even really remember the last time I've used a thruster, but it is fun. I remember the last time I did crank either, but hey. What was really funny there is that I I tapped really fast to uh, to get the thing to launch and hit S several times, and then it, it minimized the window and sent me to sticky keys. And since it minimized me, I got completely killed and they blew up my thruster and all kind of... He impounded it and then destroyed it. But I got the stuff. It was like, it just be, if it hadn't gone to sticky keys and beeped at me. Like, I'm not planning on ever using sticky keys. We expect the unexpected. Well, at least that yeah, was definitely unexpected. I think we can handle that. Yeah, I'll just drop this off and call it in at some point. That yeah, was shift, then yes. I was saying shift, 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 left shift because it gives the left shift and it does the rockets. And oh my goodness, you held down a key too fast. That must mean you want help with some. No. I'm playing a video game. You do that kind of stuff sometimes. Oh, oh. What I wanted to do was do this. Hooray! And I could have gotten away from the cops, and then when the cops were done chasing me, I would have gotten to ammo. Now, this leads me to another question of something, you know, will this work? Because I've never tried it. Can I land the thruster on the boat? KG and me. And me. Okay, but can we drive away with it on the back of the boat? It's certainly rattling around a lot. It'll be funny if the thruster explodes and then destroys the boat. Hopefully that will be not funny at all. Yeah, let's see. Well, let's see if it can survive at least long enough. this. I'm actually going to include this whole mission so you can see the moment if the thruster explodes. And it's just falling off the back of the boat. Let's 
turn before I run this puppy aground. It's still there. It's. Okay, I think we knocked everybody off. The... Is he bouncing? It's gonna go right in the ocean, isn't it? But will it blow up and take out the boat or something? the riders. Get the drivers and that usually puts everyone nice and far back. Still there. Where will it be once we cash this in? Will it just as the boat disappears will it dump it into the oh my goodness it's falling over. It's This is going to be another Moore's Mutual claim, isn't it? I don't know. With those big waves, it really jumps up. But it's not falling out. It's not falling into the ocean. Okay, I'm just so curious now. Yeah, there's a helicopter. And I can't really get an angle on it, but it doesn't matter. All we have to do is not die. still out there. That means the boat is still out there, right? In theory. Alright, I now I've got... This is a whole other... Buzzard May. Hey yo. This is something I have never done. Is gone seeing what happened to the tugboat. Oh your personal vehicle has been destroyed. Okay. The tugboat finally disappeared. <laughs> Dropped the thruster in the water. Well, now you know. I'll always wonder if I just swam out. It would have taken forever, but would I have found the boat? We may never know now. Whee! All right. Just for the record, come on, so that with the five hundred thousand I'm promised for playing in the month of May takes me to my goal of thirty million. I have another hundred thousand to play with there, so I can buy crates and earn some more money. And that's all. It's all good. That's, at least that, that's all I'm going to do with this solo session. But I feel like I should I should close it out a little bit better than that. Just to let you know, you have a happy customer. I'm going to wire you that money minus the laundering fee. Tax man's got to get something. That's a nice view. Not quite there yet, though. <sighs> flew it on back home. Time to snuggle up here with some 
endangered species blankets and call it a day.